<sighs> so what am I missing? Oh, there are two of them. The Grim Reaper and Knight of the Splend Splendent Heart. Most pilgrims of the holy capital of Oriflam pass through the penitent gate on the road from the royal meadows. Of late, however, a knight in shining armor has elected to station himself beside the entrance, accusing any and all passerbys of being Sid the Outlaw, the one who led Prince Dion down the path of destruction, and challenging them to a duel to the death. Okay, they're kind of crazy. And there's a saying amongst, amongst the Imperial soldiers of the Northreach garrison, steer clear of the drowned tower, lest the spectre sickle reap your, reap your root. I'm having trouble reading at this point, I'm kind of tired. They speak in typically uncouth terms of the thrall that dwells within the Aether Flood, Aether, the Aether Flood, one whose frightful aspect and command over lesser minions would appear to mark him as a high-ranking member of his species. People are seeing some wreck and the penitent skate some wreck. Okay, let's try to find them. So Penitent's Gate, there's one of them. Where would the other one be, though? I don't see the, the location. Let me read the name again. Cape or Seer. Oh, okay. One's over here and the other one's way over there. Okay, I better hope I don't die to them. Or at least, I guess I might hope that there's a, a obelisk somewhere near those areas. I somehow don't believe there are. Girl, come here. Fly Ambrosia. So, which one should we do first? Let's go this way first. say deep in the ether pool or ether flood so over here be safe i guess deeper in I don't even see any monsters around here. Oh, never mind. Make sure I don't have to fight a million things on the way there. Oh, one of these. 
But, uh, where's the fucking... Bahamut, okay. But, uh, where's the freaking... There's a problem. Where's the enemy, then? Definitely said Cape or Seans. Or Seer. In the ether pool. Is that it? Oh yeah. You deserve a rest. The Prince of Death. Alright, I hope he doesn't have any weird instant kill moves or anything. So slow. Maybe I can just break it right away. Ugh, not quite, never mind. Soul Harvest. God, I can't figure out the timing. God, this is so excessive. This the fall up still hit me. That's bullshit. <laughs> the second hit still hit me. He's yelling Titan, but I keep hearing my turn! Enough. There we go. Dark Steel. I can finally make the weapon I wanted to make. Okay, let's go back to the town. And Sally North. And I'm all I help the garrison today. 
Hopefully I won't end up dying to this one dragoon. I haven't seen any of those beastly blue eyes. Do be careful. Here you are. Time to fight. Guess the roads aren't safe anymore. Does this happen to be a potion? I could use a potion. Nope. Sharp Fang. Okay, yeah, this town did get ruined. It's all covered in a flood, huh? Company. Oh, there's a... Can I just approach that obelisk? I see the dragoon. I, I don't want to I don't I don't want to approach him. Thank God. I guess I never got this close to this gate. You deserve a rest. But now I can just come back to this fight. Knight of the Splendent Heart. Let's do this before you can get a hit in. Oh, that's annoying. Would you stop? Okay, I think I can kill him with this. If I can do the Sensetsu Ken before he recovers. I'm so close. There we go. <laughs> Squeeze it in. <laughs> do we get anything out of it? Just meteorite, huh? 
glad to have you back at his side. Where would I be without you? Good boy. Just step all over him. Uh. Okay. I'm gonna head back to the hideaway. Forge our last weapon and then defeat our last enemy. A Scotter Damarung. Did last you a good while. Yeah, I expected well. Anything else? That's a cool sword. Man. <laughs> I still I guess I need to do all of these, but I probably will do them on my own time. Make for origin. If this game has a, if the game has a post game and it lets me do all of these before I transition to new game plus, that would be nice. But I probably have to keep a separate save file for that kind of thing if I want to do it. Hi, Nectar. Do you have anything to say? Ask about Nectar's adventure. Did I ever tell you about where I came from, Kubo? You're not from the forest. Well, I'm from a forest, certainly, but which forest? Well, which forest? I can't tell you that. It's a secret, Kubo. Then what were you going to tell me? Nothing. I was just making sure I hadn't said anything I wasn't supposed to. And if you had? You don't want to know, Koopa. Well, if that's that, I don't suppose there's anything new here, right? Yeah, also we got everything. A new dawn. Come again. I may have more for ya. I think at least. Oh, there's uh <laughs> There's an update from Tomes. I may not read any of it. It depends on the kind of entry we're looking at. I don't want to talk to you about that. Compiled some new entries. If you would like to see them, Max Sage for the ages. I believe you <laughs> achieved academic ascendancy. Okay, interesting. Oh God. Uh, this mother crystal communicated directly with Origin. From whence Ultima kept watch on the world from its slumber. And so those people who lived around it had a close relationship with their creator than most. It was they who formed the circle of founded the circle of Malleus to keep the world the word of their lord and future savior alive. After the tragedy of Domecus on the first fall of humanity, the few survivors of the children fled to the outer continent, where they continued to worship their god and await the day when they would join him in paradise. The Ultima Civilization. The ancient civilization of the godlike Ultima Collective. Their discovery of magic helped them to thrive, but came at a terrible cost. So, Ultima is a collective, actually. It's like the ghost of a people. After their, their cities fell and their people perished, the few survivors fled to the untouched land of Alistia to lay the groundwork for their future revival. The apoditary beneath Phoenix Gate and the Tower of Reverie in Walud are both relics of their civilization and far predate those of the Fallen. That is interesting.
they aid in the perfection of his vessel. I wonder if something happens if you do all of them then. Hmm. In the future, the Lord will reappear and remake the world. Guide the chosen to heaven, so on and so forth. Solus Automata, largely composed of ether, whose only motivation is to see the weirdest will is done. Mm -hmm. An incident in which the Fallen launched an assault on the Mother Crystal of Demekis to claim its power, and in so doing stoked the ire of Ultima himself. In response, the self-proclaimed god destroyed the crystal, leaving behind both a, gra a great yawning crater and a cautionary legend that has since spread throughout Valisthea. Okay. What subject shall we consider today? And do we have everything? It was like the whole cast. We look at that. How about the beast fury? Damn. <laughs> okay. Well, so we have every single... <laughs> every single... Uh, Did you learn item in the journal... Now unlocked for our perusal, if we so choose to read it. I wish I knew what I'm missing. Uh, there may be something for doing all the uh, the obelisks, not the obelisks, the the trial stones, the little bloody palaces. Uh, I'm gonna do not gonna do those now. There may be something for collecting all our Castrians as well. I guess we'll see. Uh, let me just save. I'll, I'll get two separate save files while I'm at it. Okay. Let's head on to what I believe will be the final dungeon. up there tell him we were right to leave his legacy with you <laughs> tell him he'll be in the front row there's no way he'd miss this well behave yourself mid 
We'll see. Do I know her? <laughs> so, you're in charge now, Gav. And what does Taya have to say about that? Come back before she finds out, eh? Sorry. Your Grace, I shall pray for your safe return. That's kind of you, but you should pray he took his medicine. I didn't spend all night grinding herbs for his lordship to leave them on his nightstand. Again. <laughs> you needn't fear, Lady Tyre. And thank you. See that your brother comes back in one piece. Or... At most two. Any more and you can heal him yourself. I'll keep that in mind. Well, there's nothing to say that hasn't already been said. But that's never stopped me before. So just you do what needs doing. And don't worry about us. We'll do our best, Uncle. That we will. Hmm. If that is all? Not quite. Jill. It's time, isn't it? It is. Take care of him. Are we losing dark combos? Not that I was particularly good at using them. Kept forgetting he existed, but... <laughs> You're such a good boy, you can't take him away from us. Don't forget, Clyde. We all choose our own path. Believe in yours. I do. I'll be back, I promise. I love you, Jill. I know. <laughs> I love you too. These two are great. It's a good pair. And I'm glad it's clear that it's like these two characters just like each other. They're they're one again in a relationship. Oh, I guess everyone from the other towns is here too. <laughs> I I feel like I've been dealing with too many games where they want to keep it ambiguous. So it's like, oh, everyone fucking loves the protagonist. Let the player choose who he'll bang. Can't believe Jill can't come with us. That makes me sad.
Oh, haven't they fallen off already? <laughs> they just not think too hard about that. So, this is Origin. A far cry from heaven. Where it all began. Where it all begins. Our Ark. Your architect. Was here that we slumbered, here that we waited for centuries, clinging to our decrepit shell for fear that we might have need of it once again. But you have come at last. And now we shall be truly complete. Well? There's three of us, and one of him. Let's make it count. <laughs> Not risen, huh? Oh, he really just wanted to remake his old body, huh? Ultima Prime. <laughs> Zero damage. <laughs> oh, you took damage.
<laughs> it's so weird seeing health bars for a cutscene battle. <laughs> just watch us get bodied. I wonder what happens if you let yourself... if you fail these QTs. Taking so little damage. <laughs> oh shit. Try disaster. <laughs> Got that light speed. <laughs> you see he's missing some screaming oh god He has the same injury.
I guess this is how they set up for the dungeon itself. No. Did I mention you look terrible? <laughs> that makes two of us. No, oh, I'll be all right. Dion. <sighs> Joshua, can you explain to me what the point of that blue thing you have ended up being? Can you take it out? Does it make a difference at this point? This prison. Ultima seems pretty free. Would it be worse without it? I need answers. Press on. Always. You know, I wanted to look behind me, but the game makes it very hard. Only press on. No looking back. I'm sorry about Dion. Don't be. Please. He did what he had to do. And it's time we did the same. Should we stop? Yeah, because of the cough. Yeah, I think we're past that, Clive. <laughs> I suppose we are. That light, so cold, so empty. We're close, aren't we? It uh, seems that way. But I don't want to think what could be waiting for us in there. Then think instead of those waiting for us at home. Together, 
we may usher in a new age of reason. This was never about creation. Only self-preservation. You condemned an entire world so that you alone might escape death alone. Him alone. Life. I think I understand. He... I guess that part was kind of predictable. Welcome home, brother. <laughs> oh, so does that mean there were multiple Ultimas running around? So when we destroy the Mother Crystal, one of them. So no wonder, <laughs> no wonder Ultima was able to act so freely. So this is what they refer to as the Ultima Collective in that entry then. Oh boy. So we strayed from his path to forge one of our own. So absorbed was he in his own desires, so driven by his own will alone, that he shunned the one thing that could have made him truly powerful. Faith. The same faith people now place in you. Faith that you will fulfill their dream, Sid's dream, of creating a better world for us. Oh yeah, sure. Friendship. In father's footsteps, and save those who need saving most. It's friendship that will save the day. You will answer Jill's plea 
to save yourself. The difference is, Clive, you chose to listen, and that is what has steeled our bonds. Bonds that helped you stand firm when Ultima's pole was at its strongest. His power may be absolute, but so is ours. And so will yours be. With my light in your heart, not even a god might stop us. Joshua! Enough, Clive. My body is too far gone. If the wound does not take me, the curse will. No. Seems like now it's for real, though. Open your eyes. Open your eyes, he has the part of the phoenix, but I don't think he can do it. It wouldn't be right to have another miracle at this point, right? Why does it look hotter now? <laughs> I mean, why am I asking? <laughs> 